Thank you, July. Thank you, everybody. Hope you guys did have a lot of fun and learning, a lot of tactile things that I do with them because preschoolers learn best when they can do activities and learn and actually see. Okay, so... <laughs> All right, so at this time, they're going to learn, they're going to um, do a little poem about pumpkins, because we did learn a lot about fall words, and pumpkins, they all drew a picture of a pumpkin with a silly feature to it, and after the ceremony, you all will be welcome to go downstairs to the classroom, and they will show you their portfolios. So right now, Jenny will start us with our pumpkin poem. Thank you, preschoolers. Awesome, awesome job. And at this time, I will be passing out certificates. I will say something that each child contributed to the class or something that I recognize that I feel they should be awarded for the certificate for the class for. And I will start with Eli. And if you like, you can come up and get your, your uh, certificate if you can move. All right, so Eli. Eli is really smart beyond his age. He's always there like a teacher's aide, ready to help the other kids who don't understand things or need a helping hand. Um, he's funny and makes friends quickly, and he's being awarded for most helpful. He's very, very helpful and keeps me laughing when he helps me with things also. There you go, Eli. You're welcome. <laughs> Mo, Mo, I've noticed on several accounts be very helpful and kind to not only her brother, but other students. No one goes left behind for Mo. She always goes back and makes sure they are okay or makes sure they understand the assignment. So I award Mo with most loving student. There you go, Mo. You're welcome. Um, Gracie and Paige, you guys can come up together. You two. <laughs> These two have been so much fun this term. They have been a joy to the class, and I most enjoyed them in my classroom. These two together always participate in an activity and make the most out of it and getting the class to laugh. They both are getting the certificate for most entertaining. There you go, Gracie. And Paige. <laughs> July. <laughs> 
July is eager to learn, always helping, looking to answer a question, and always quick to volunteer and take new challenges. July is being recognized as most attentive. Thank you. Good job. You're welcome. Dylan has impressed me more than once with her assignments turned in and her stories shared. She puts forth her best foot in everything she does, and it's why I award her for most hardworking. And there you go, Dylan. Good job. <laughs> You're welcome. And Tina... <laughs> Tina is the student that never takes anything too serious and tries to get the class to have the same approach. This really helps with bringing kids closer together and just letting loose and having fun. She shares her nature with the class and it's why I award her with most easygoing. There you go, Tina. Good job. <laughs> Yanni, she takes everything with a positive attitude and never looks at anything as being a boring assignment or not fun, but takes it on with a smile and always comes through on activity. Yanni is being awarded with the best attitude. There you go, Yanni. Where are you at? There you are. <laughs> Octavia is not with us, but I will go ahead and say hers. Little Octavia continued to intrigue me with her love of all people and a heart for having the best and wanting the best. In her story sharing and activities, she always has a very unique approach, and it's why I wrote her with the best diva. <laughs> um, Jenny is always so sweet and by my side, ready for class, always on time, and looking to please. I'm awarding Jenny with best character. There you go, Jenny. Good job, everybody. <laughs> you guys are awesome. You are very welcome. And now, we will wrap up the class, of the ceremony for the class, with a fun Halloween song. As you can see, they're all in their costumes, and they had a small party last night. So after the ceremony is over, we can go downstairs and have 